and then there were two. Hey guys, today we're taking a look at the Fortnite Hasbro Victory Royale series links action figure. If you don't already know, we did Chaos Agent and Midas Rex as videos. Link to those guys will be down below in the description. But today we're taking a look at Lynx herself. We've only got Ripley in her left, so you might as well take a look at this awesome figure. Taking a look at the packaging right here, you got her name, an awesome picture of her, and here's her accessories. You got the back bling, the gun, and the pickaxe. On the back, it shows the figure right here and the rest of the accessories. And honestly, this is just going to look like a really sleek and awesome figure. I can't wait to open her up, so let's crack open her packaging and see what she has to offer. All right, so here's the figure out of her packaging, and I will say this just looks so sleek and cool. Like, the figure really looks a lot like Catwoman, and I like how they chose this black style for Lynx. It just looks really good in figure form. Going over some details, you can see, like, the front and the back of her. This tail can actually move around, which is pretty cool, and she's just got some really awesome line work running around the suit. You got some details right here with these weird triangles to make this sort of gradient effect. You even got these little triangles on the helmet too. It just looks really awesome and just looks so sleek and I don't know. Something about it looks super cool. Going over accessories, we have her pickaxe right here, which doesn't have any color to it. For the other edit styles, they have some like colors glowing off of it, but it's just black and gray. Very plain. It does match the figure a lot though, but I would have liked to see maybe something a little bit different or something else other than this. We also have a P90 and SMG right here. This is okay. We haven't really seen this looking like this in Legendary Series. We've had we have seen it before, but this is like all black and then you got some of this green. It's definitely more detailed than the Legendary Series one. And then she can hold this and just shoot away at people. And then also we have this back wing right here. I don't like the inclusion of this because this looks so random on the skin. There, like that does not match Lynx at all. I don't really know why it's here, but it is this weird stuffed animal with this like uh, bandaged over eye. Very creepy and it just doesn't make sense with the figure at all. But going over our articulation, she has a ball joint at the head here. So you could probably take this off, but I'm not gonna try. You got a neck piece that can move up and down. So some really great articulation there. Ab crunch right here, and then you can move right here up and down at the waist. The tail can move around a lot, which is awesome. You can do a full rotation. Don't know why you would wanna do that. And then we have the arms can go out here. They can swivel at the shoulder. I'm pretty sure, yes, we do have butterflies right there. Double jointed elbows, which are really awesome. You got trigger fingers right there, so they move up and down and they can rotate around. Legs kick out, and then they go pretty much all the way back. And then you can bend at the double knees. It goes all the way over there. She's got some hip swivel right here. And then you got some ankle movement up and down. And that's pretty sick. Let's compare her to some figures. Here we have her Jazzwares figure, just to kind of show you what they look like. Yeah, so you can see the different color palettes. Obviously, they're not the same size. But I do like this sleek black. It looks way better. Here's her up next to John Walker, the U.S. agent from Marvel Legends. Obviously, she's going to be a little bit smaller than him. But that looks really cool. And then let's compare her to Midas Rex right here. And yeah, so she's a little bit smaller than the rest. But I guess that's how she's built. So it kind of makes sense. So I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, leave a like. And of course, if you haven't already and you want to see more of this, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.